everyone! A long time no vlog, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> the thing is that I kept starting vlogs for the past few months and then would either forget I was vlogging or I would film the whole vlog and then not have the time to edit it, like work with the footage or whatever, and so it just felt irrelevant to post it. So, sorry about that, but here we go. I feel like this is gonna be a good week, so I feel like this vlog is actually gonna happen for once. Um, I'm back in London for like a whole month, which is nice because I've been traveling a lot, as you know, for the whole of this year. Um, just recently I went and spent two weeks in Europe, and then before that, uh, I had two weeks in the States, so yeah, just just a lot's been going down. Um, I'm trying to remember like where I ended off in the last vlog and what I was talking to about to see what I need to update you on. Uh, I don't think perhaps that I'd hung this picture yet up when I filmed the last vlog, I think then the last vlog had arrived, but yeah. That is up now and I have a bunch more art hanging out down here that I need to put up on the wall, but we just got this beautiful shelf in here and have moved the record player into my office which is fun so yeah I'm gonna give you like a tour through all of all of the whole setup here when I eventually film an office slash workspace tour video which will probably be coming in the new year to be honest today is November what's the date 26th which is Cyber Monday and uh, what I've been working on for the past week is this page here for ConvertKit's Cyber Monday promotion so it's got like a little timer, it's got this graphic that I really struggled with but I'm super happy with how it came out in the end. Um, this creator starter kit is what we're calling it. I'm really proud of it because I managed to code a thing because like this is like a deal right that goes live at a certain time and the time that it went live at was like 5am London time and I didn't want to get up to put that live. So I wrote some PHP that like at a certain time would swap the code out from a holding page to this full like landing page where you can buy the deal. Um, and it worked. So that's really exciting. A little bit of a coding win there. Um, I wanted to, I'm just going to pop you down on my iMac stand actually because I want to talk to you about something. Um, I have decided that I'm going to be taking a break from YouTube for most of December. So like this is the last video of mine you're going to see this year. If you saw my anniversary video that I did uh, maybe like a month and a bit ago by now, I don't even know. Time flies. Time flies. But I have been making YouTube videos for over five years now. And in that time, I have never missed a single week of uploading. I've uploaded at least one video every single week for, you know, that five and a bit years. Um, and I just need a break, to be honest. I think it is time. I really didn't want to break the streak, you know. It became like a point of pride for me that um, I've been making videos for this long and I just, you know, wanted to keep going. Um, but... Paul Jarvis is a creative that I really admire. He is a really good writer, he's got a great blog, he has a great like email newsletter, um, he's a designer as well. He takes a break from his newsletter every holiday season, so it's like um, mid-November I think through the rest of the year he stops sending emails and like writing his blog posts and it's like a, a scheduled thing. So he doesn't count it as like breaking a streak because it's planned, right? It's, he plans to take that break. It's a busy time of year, people don't have much time to be consuming content anyway, and so it just makes sense. And yeah, I really like that idea. So I'm gonna be taking December off YouTube and coming back in the new year, which will be great because I think I'll have like, I don't know, renewed excitement for it and I'll be able to get some things done in the meantime as well. Like finally build out my blog, um, you know, I started that website redesign series a while ago and I just haven't had the time to actually keep going with it. Like, yeah, life has been so busy that making more intense videos like that just hasn't been able to happen. So, yeah, I guess I'll still be making content in December, but just not posting it yet. Hope that's cool with you. Hope you understand and that you won't miss me too much. I'm sure you won't. But anyway, this is your last video for the year, so I'm going to try and make it a good one. Uh, and to start off with, I'm gonna go do some work, so here's some montage of me working. <laughs> this is the face of someone who just went to the gym for the first time in like, God, must be at least a month. Oh my gosh, I feel like I nearly died. My legs are so sore, I'm out of breath. I'm gonna have a shower, get some coffee, and get to work. So, welcome to Tuesday, I guess. What a flattering start to the day. <laughs> Wow, 
Well, it is now Thursday. My legs are still incredibly sore from the workout that I did on Tuesday. I guess that's what you get for not going to the gym for a while. I want to show you something pretty exciting that arrived yesterday. This is my stage piano. And don't be fooled by the name, I will not be playing it on any stages, but I just really wanted to learn how to play the piano. I've been wanting to learn for a long time, um, and I just decided that I need a hobby that is not on the computer, so this is going to be my non-computer hobby. However, in this small London flat, I definitely couldn't fit an actual piano anywhere, so I got this digital one. It is, like, I don't know what I expected, but it is definitely longer <laughs> than I expected, because um, it's a full, like, 88 keys, like the piano is. Anyway, I um, was playing with it last night. It's super fun. I did not order a stand for it, because I thought that I would just, like, put it on my desk, but I've decided that, actually, I could get... A stand and like have it sitting here kind of in front of the window so that's the plan um the stand should be arriving today i think so yeah we'll see but i'm really excited about that i'm not good uh, i played keyboard when i was mm, like a kid and a teenager with that i was playing like with the right hand and then just doing chords with the left hand so i do have a bit of experience that i feel like will translate over to playing the piano properly with like both hands but yeah it's definitely gonna be frustrating for a while while i wait like, and like practice until I get good, you know, but hey, it's, it'll be fun to learn. And I've downloaded an app, of course, <laughs> with some lessons and stuff. Yeah. Anyway, right now I'm off to the supermarket because I really want to get a croissant for breakfast. That is just what I'm craving today. So that's what I'm going to do. ready to film a video and here is my like secret to when I film videos um, I like to have my face done and my hair looking nice when I film a video just because I don't know then I feel more confident publishing it on the internet obviously not in these vlogs you often see me looking terrible in these vlogs but yeah for my more like um, educational videos I suppose the ones where I sit on my camera and light some things I like to put in a bit more effort um, and I like to film these videos on days when I am going out in the evening or like I don't know um, out there's an event in the city or something like that. That way I feel like it's less of a waste and I'm not just doing my hair and makeup for a video, you know. And tonight I'm going to see Bring Me the Horizon play at Alexander Palace. Very excited. So yeah, I'm gonna film a video right now and like put some makeup on for the day. Just getting myself all set up to film. Microphone here, camera here, a light. I'm filming out in the living room because my office is a mess and it was easier to just come film out here than to tidy it, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, way to avoid the problem. I've been experiencing some frustrating code issues today. Um, I was trying to get like a local install of our conference site working on the iMac that I'm using now and just like wasn't working properly. Um, the code is the exact same as uh, on my like 15 inch laptop where it works perfectly but like I must have not installed something properly or set something up right, I don't know. Um, but it means that I've just been using my laptop most of the day today instead of the iMac. Right now I'm just making a cup of tea before my afternoon meetings. On Thursdays I have our all team meeting and then um, I have like just our marketing team meeting right after it. So I'm going to go to those things and then I get to go see Bring Me The Horizon tonight which I'm so excited about. Did I talk about that already? Good morning! I got home pretty late last night. We're talking like, mm, I think like quarter past midnight, which is very late for me. I'm usually someone who is in bed by like 10pm most nights. Um, the concert was amazing. Loved it. Had such a fun time, have kind of like lost my voice a little bit apparently from like yelling along to the songs, but yeah, it was so much fun. My office is still a complete and total mess, so I am really looking forward to getting that sorted out, but I'm also getting my day started pretty late because I like had a bit of a sleep in, so yeah, it's probably gonna stay messy all day today while I work. Right now I'm going to go make juice and um, what I tend to do in the mornings because my most of my team is based in the US is I spend it catching up on things that happened in Slack and Basecamp while I was like offline and asleep. So I'm gonna get a juice and read through some stuff. Something 
have actually been um, kind of enjoying now that I like know how to code is almost designing in the browser for the breakpoint. This right here is a landing page for our conference. It's just like an initial one, a quick one, so that we can sell tickets before like we've um, published all the speakers and things like that. So um, I built it out here. This is what it's looking like on this breakpoint. And as I'm going down, I'm like just seeing how it, what happens automatically with the code and yeah, making changes from there. So like right now I am working on like, mm, what do I really want these to do? Like how do I want these pictures to overlap? I think I'm gonna like move this up. I don't know, but yeah, I quite, quite liking this way of working. I think I like it because um, I don't know, I'm not very good at using all of the responsive stuff in Figma that you know makes things arrange themselves or whatever as you shrink the canvas artboard frame, whatever they call it, size. So, you know, doing this, stuff resizes by itself and I can just tweak a few things to move it around with the added benefit that once I've done that, it's built and that's just what it's gonna look like on the live site, so I think that's pretty cool. Definitely still a strong advocate for designing before you go about building a page though, in general. Um, this, like the breakpoints, the smaller screen sizes is really the only place that I will just code without designing first. Friday evening just playing around the piano. I'm using this app called Flowkey that like has courses and it like uses the microphone to listen to you play when you get the right notes but it's kind of annoying because it means that I can't just like wear headphones while I practice if I want to use this app I mean but yeah I'm still still looking if you've got any recommendations for me of good apps or books courses whatever to learn the piano then please tell me them down below in the description because I'm really excited about this. It's fun to have you know, a hobby that's not on the computer, even though, I mean, I'm looking at an iPad, so it's still a screen, but hey. Like I said at the start of this vlog, this is gonna be the last video for 2018, which feels weird. Like, like I said, I haven't taken a week off making a video for ever. <laughs> ever since I started, I've been making videos every single week, so yeah. It's gonna be a good break though, I think. I'm gonna come back renewed, refreshed, with a lot of great content for you, which I'm really excited about. And you don't have to miss me too much because I will still be tweeting way too much, that's for sure. And I've also been really enjoying Instagram stories lately. So yeah, head on over, follow me in those two places and that's where you'll find me for the rest of December. All right, thank you so much for watching this vlog. I really appreciate your support. Have a good week and I guess I'll see you next year. <laughs>